<laughs> oh yeah. I think I got worms. So I thought today we would make a worm bowl <laughs> out of these really nasty, smelly worms. Oh, yes. Oh, and they smell really bad. Or maybe we can make a worm bowl. Right, the worms are floating too much, so I don't have any more worms, because ideally what I could do is put some more and push them down, but I don't have any. So I'm gonna have to put this in a smaller container. But before we carry on, I've gotta say a massive thank you to today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. You've probably heard about this by now, but let me tell you why. In terms of gameplay, it's the most deepest, most complex mobile game around. With 500 champions to collect, each with their own skill trees and millions of artifacts to find and equip. No two champions will ever be the same. That makes for literally trillions of ways to build your teams. Crazy depth and endless strategies to figure out. Raid is free to play and is available on both mobile and PC. This game is pretty epic. Check this out. The gameplay in this is crazy. You just get lost in it. So you might be asking, what's new for September, Nick? Raid have just released a huge champion update, tweaking and rebalancing over 20 different champions to make PvP arena battles even more competitive <laughs> and if that's not enough the forge just came out so now you can save time and start crafting top quality artifacts and competing right away it's pretty intense <laughs> so what are you waiting for go to the video description click on the special links and if you're a new player you'll get 100,000 silver plus one free champion, Chandler. Oh, oh yes, look at this guy. This is an amazing epic champion to start with. <laughs> All this treasure will be waiting for you right here. There's no better time to get playing this game, folks. So check out the links in the description. Oh, and don't forget, these rewards will only be available for the next 30 days and are only for new players. Good luck, and I'll see you there. Okay, we are ready. I've cleaned up most of the mess. Uh, we got our worms in some resin. Um, not quite at the bottom, but we've got a good majority of them in there, so hopefully that will set quite well. Let's get it in the pressure pot and come back to it when it's done. In case any of you folks was wondering, these worms are already dead. Okay, let's have a look in here, folks. This is going to be a bit weird. <laughs> oh, nice little worms. So there it is, folks. Oh, oh. it's a bit greasy. It's solid, but it's just grease on it. I don't know why. Worm grease, maybe? <laughs> oh, there we go. Ooh, look at these worms. All right, let's get these on the lathe and see what we can make. Picked up some new 
handy tools from Record Power. Oh yes. Let's check these out on the lathe. These worms are cutting up really nice with me new tools. I haven't a clue what we're gonna be making. <laughs> so as you can see, I've been roughing this down. I uh, need a little bit more work, but the worms, um, well, the resin is kind of like, well, it's not really, it's not really sealed in there very well, really. Uh, it's sort of a bit bitty, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, so I don't know if this is actually gonna work out and we're gonna actually be able to make anything from it. Because if you can see, let me zoom you in. See, there's like just bits taken out of it everywhere. So it hasn't really sort of like settled inside. The resin hasn't sort of gone all in there. And I think if we just keep taking it, it's just gonna take bits and chunks and chunks out of it. See, this is what we want. We want this here to be a bit smooth, but I don't think it's gonna, it's gonna do that. We'll keep going and see how we get on. Oh, they still absolutely stink. These worms haven't really turned very well. They actually look kind of funky. So look at this. Look how this has turned out. I've just hollowed it all out. Um, now, obviously, it's not got a smooth finish, but actually the finish is actually quite cool. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to make a little lid for this, a little wooden lid. And I think that might look a bit quite nice. It does smell still <laughs> of worms, dead ones, but it does actually look kind of groovy La Tigra. so hollowed it out looks like wheat bix doesn't it <laughs> or shredded wheat or something <laughs> so um yeah I'll, I'll give it a bit more sand in we'll stick some yorkshire grit on it we love a bit of yorkshire and then we'll make a cheeky little lid now we're gonna spread some yorkshire grit all over these worms but they're gonna love it if you're a make essential member you get some discount off this stuff link below
Worm pot. Anyone? Yep, yeah, I know it's not everyone's cup of worms, but. <clears throat> My apologies. I think the lid <laughs> fitted pretty well because I did that wrong. <laughs> what I should have done is not taken off the back first. I should have left that bolted to the lathe and then I should have uh, worked on the lid and then got that to fit and then left it on the lathe to finish it. I forgot to do that, so I ended up kind of doing it another way around, just with a bit of measurement and uh, it worked out all right. And it fits not bad. It's not quite a tight fit, but it's good enough. It looks kind of like a coffee pot or something, doesn't it? Or a teapot. Um, it's not, it's a worm pot though. Oh, it does stink as well. <laughs> Well, actually, it's not that bad. You kind of get used to it. It's not, it's not like bad, bad. It's just a bit weird. Got my emblem in the back there. Um, don't know why, but I just thought I would. Um, and there's the inside. Not too bad, you can't really see it. There's a bit dark. But uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Another weird one for you. Well, I do hope you thought that was strange enough. Check out these new tools, folks. I'll leave a link below. Actually, if you check out Maker Central members, if you're not a member yet, then give it a look up. We've got some really cool discounts for you guys, including stuff from Record Power. I think they've got their chuck up there at the moment with a nice cheeky discount on it. So many other companies have partnered up with us and it's to help you make. Loads of discounts for you in there. We're working on more companies to come over, so there'll be more discounts coming soon. Link below. Well, I won't waffle on too long, folks. Please check out my sponsor today, Raid Shadow Legends. It's great to have these sponsors on the channel. It really does make a big difference, and it makes a huge difference if you go and check them out. It's free. Why not? I also just want a massive shout out to my little boy, Charlie the Maker. Please go and check his channel out. Give him a little subscribe. He's pumping out the videos every week. Bless him, he's getting really into making stuff and his videos are doing really well. Uh, he's making some really nice wood turning stuff. He makes some clocks, bowls and pots and all sorts of different stuff. Made some pendants the other day. So please check him out, give him a little subscribe because he loves making stuff and loves showing all of you what he can do. Well, that's it from me, folks. I hope you like this one. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. And if you fancy sharing the video, that really does help. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please smash that subscribe button Thanks for everyone's support so far. And thanks to all my Patreon supporters. You are awesome. Take care, folks. Have a fab weekend. And I'll see you really soon.